You ready? You ready? All right, so here we go. This highly anticipated fight is now underway. Looks like a classic matchup of striker versus grappler. Am I simplifying things too much? In this instance, you aren't, because this is what got these two men to the show. Right. One guy is known for his diverse attack on the feet. The other guy is known for his ability to drag the fight to the mat and put his opponents in danger from the very start of the grappling exchanges. Oh, really using his reach advantage as he landed the jab there. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. Man, he is so sound defensively. Nice job to raise the guard there. It's the relaxation that allows him to see things coming and block most of the strikes that are coming at him. Nice one, two there. And he landed the right hand there. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the cover. Rock him, suck him out of the shoot here. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? That's a pretty good right hand there by your teammate, Khabib Nurmagomedov, DC. You're so worried about the wrestling that when the hands come, you're not expecting it. And Habib lands early and he lands off. Great punch. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. And a nice jab there, champ. The jab was a lost art in mixed martial arts. Guys have found it, and they are fighting behind it real well. Hook to the head there by Nirago Medoff. Another clinch position. They continue to exchange. All right, boy, tie clinch. A lot of elbows and knees could be coming from here. We'll see how he chooses to accept. Yeah, it's a very dangerous position, but an advantageous one for the offensive fighter. Watch for the defensive guy to try to break this immediately. Nice job moving off the center line. He slips to avoid that right hand. open, you're going to pay the price, and he certainly did there as his opponent lands flush to the midsection. Single collar tie now. Nermago Medov's got the tie clinch. Let's see what he can do. Oh, nice slip to avoid that right hand. Oh, that's a nice strike there by Nermago Medov. You're always thinking wrestling when you fight Habib, but you better be very weary of his stand-up. He's developing his skill every single day. Oh, and there is the kick. That one checked by Nermago Medov. What a punch. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Another punch to the head. He's really turning every part of himself into those strikes to the head. Oh, nice land there with the punch. You see, he's taking advantage of what is an obvious edge and reach. Oh, flush knee to the body. He's got the length advantage in this fight and certainly made it count in that exchange. Oh, straight to the body by Nurmagomedov. Tags him with the left. Man, look at him load up on that right. Nice straight punch. Nurmago Medov gets caught by that straight punch. His defense has abandoned him tonight. Oh, man, that's a nice kick right there. He's doing a great job of landing that kick over and over again. Just out of range with the big right hand. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Well, he's doing a nice job here blocking these shots. The chin is tucked, the hands are high. Pretty good job defensively thus far. Great job defensively. He's seeing everything coming. Hardy right, closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Effective punch there by Nurmagomedov. 
That horn sounds means we have reached the end of round one. All right, there's the horn, and what a round it was. DC, take us through the replays. Punch after punch. He landed him at will. He went right at his opponent, got in his face, and showed this is my octagon. We are going to dance to the beat of my two. All right, here we go with our next round. A lot to be happy about in that Ready? previous round. He was attacking the head at will, and until his opponent adjusts, might as well go back to it. There was no negative to him headhunting. Most times the coaches yell, don't headhunt, don't headhunt. I'm yelling headhunt in front of his corner because every time he's thrown, he's landing. Big punch land. Ooh. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. Oh, and he tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Nermont Homeadam. He's got to start moving his head. He cannot take this many shots to the head. Really timing his shots nicely. Good tempo, very accurate, finding the range with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job of really overwhelming his opponent with activity. Nice uppercut counter there by Nervago Meta. Oh, and he lands a punch there. Good connection by him on that. Great connect, so fast, so accurate. And watch the ability to land from anywhere. Oh, some blood in and around the eyebrow now. That shot opened him up. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's still safe, but he's also gonna be able to land. He's gotta be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. I mean, this guy is really focused on those punches to the head inside of the clinch. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Great connection. He's in a great flow right now. And they separate. Just over three minutes to go now. Zermako Medov gets stung by that leg kick. Oh, nice right hand. Marco Medov shot is blocked. Right hand punch to the clinch. Well, a really good second round for him thus far after a somewhat lackluster first round. He has found the rhythm and found his striking range. Scary proposition for the opponent now here in round two. And they separate. Oh, caught him flush with the head kick. What a kick by this young man. He does a great job of disguising that technique, and before you know it, boom, he lands. He comes forward with a flying knee that just missed hitting the target flush. Big kick lands. Lands with a right hand. Oh, a nice punch out of the break there after he had caught the leg, so he is really starting to put it all together now, and clearly seems to have found the timing of his opponent. Good punch lands. Right hand punch to the clinch. A oh, really good job by him there to raise the guard, DC, and block those shots coming his way. He does a great job of blocking all incoming strikes. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Well, you start to really worry about the wrestling, and there's that left hand from Cubby. Underrated. I mean, it's a very underrated part of his game, his ability to stand and strike with anybody in the UFC. Well, he has certainly kept the punch counters busy tonight. He's landed a ton of significant strikes and clearly is winning this fight tonight. Winning this fight going away, and it's one of those rare instances where everything comes together. Oh, nice. Well, if you're gonna leave your body that wide open, you're gonna pay the price, and he certainly did there as his opponent lands flush to the midsection. Big punch from the clinch. That kick blocked by Nermago Metal. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Ooh, head kick lands and hurt. Shows him the left and then follows it up with a right. Nice one-two punch there by Nermago Meta.
stuffs that takedown attempt without issue. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Gotta be careful here to not empty the gas tank. So far, so good, though, in this round. Whoa! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh, he might be out. Oh! Left hook, right hand. And we got a fight on our hands. Take a look back at some of the highlights from that last round, DC. A lot for the replay guys to choose from. I mean, these guys are going to be very busy trying to find what replay to show you guys. Lands on both sides of the octagon. Both guys fought great. What a phenomenal round. All right, here we go with our next round. His opponent is going to need some Motrin later tonight. How about all those strikes to the head he absorbed in the previous round? He is not moving his head. He's trying to walk forward. He's a pressure fighter, sure, but he's trying to walk forward with no head movement, and he is paying the price for it but by getting hit over and over in the face. Oh, tags him with that uppercut. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Great punch. What does he follow that uppercut with next time? He lands it so effectively. Well, eventually, you know he's going to turn this defense into offense, but he's certainly doing a nice job on the defensive end this way. They talk about the feeling out process. He's getting his opponent's timing. Now he's blocking everything. Expect counters as we go forward. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Ooh, what a punch. Just misses with the straight right. Oh, man, that cut is nasty. And they separate. Nurmagomedov gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. Oh, looked like that left hand found the target. Found the target as it has on so many occasions tonight. Oh, nice jab. And they separate. Ooh, big shot land. Trying to double up on that jab. Oh, collar tie. Nicely done there to keep his hands up and block that strike. He's got to protect that cut if he wants to keep the doctor out. He's got to protect the cut, John, but he's also got to be very aware because if he's got a smart opponent, opponent's going to start finding the body now because he knows the hands are really high to try to protect that cut. Not there. Straight right hand, no good. The number's unofficial, but strong. 129. His total strikes have now landed for Khabib Nurmagomedov. Well, and in terms of the efficiency on the feet, landing with 36% accuracy here thus far against Khabib Nurmagomedov. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much. Whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got a pressure. He's got to go chase that finish down now. So holding on to him here, not doing a ton, perhaps just looking to recover. Oh, nice connection by him there with the right hand. The right hand is the dominant hand, and you can see how well he throws it. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively protecting the head and sort of maybe letting his opponent gas out a little bit with all the volume. His opponent sees the target, but he can't get to the target. So he'll continue to throw, and he'll continue to wear on his own gas tank. Nice punch land over the top. Magomedov gets hit by that leg kick. May not be a bad idea to start to check some of these. Oh, lands another beautiful strike to the body. Really starting to connect at will when it comes to work in the body, and especially effective doing it later in this fight. Didn't see a lot of that from him in the early rounds. I mean, 
look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Oh. Single collar tie there. An elbow! Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves to go finish this fight. Good stick. Oh! Start looking at the finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. comes the separation now. That's a big strike right there. Oh, single collar tie here. Oh, and there's a takedown attempt, DC. Not a great one. Might as well tell your opponent you're shooting, huh? Yeah, he's your best friend. Tell him that you want to take him to his back and watch him defend and then beat you up as a fight stand. All right, so a big knockdown for him, courtesy of that punch in that round. DC, here's your replay. Big moment in the previous round. They were both fighting very well, but when he landed this punch right here that sits his opponent down, it showed that the power is not equal, and if he can land, he does have the ability to damage it. Just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Big punch lands through the middle. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. up here and now figures to rain down some ground strikes. Yeah, the ground and pound will be a plenty from this position. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. fighter here pretty soon. That left eye starting to shut. Well, the ground and pound has been on point tonight. Good work here by Nermago Meta. Oh, and that is it. Referee has seen enough, and maybe so have we. Your winner by TKO. That was a great performance. Way to land those strikes and go and chase down the finish when you get an opportunity.
this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet spot that ended his opponent's night. And here once more with the official decision is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve LeBing has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 33 seconds of round number four. Declared the winner by knockout, Khabib the Eagle Hermano Bueno. All right, so there he is, the man of the moment, celebrating one of the bigger knockout victories of his career. And got to be nice sometimes with all the hard work that you guys put in when it goes down exactly the way you do. A lot of people talk about doing certain things. It's harder to deliver on those promises you make to the public. Tonight, he did exactly that. 